Hi everybody, and welcome to my last match in the Menagerie Mix group stage, um, in which we are playing against H.exe executable, and we get to start this. Um, we get to start this first board. Um, so what is this? We've got Way of the Mole. This could be nice with Village Green. And we've got the we've got Shepherds for draw, I guess, and also Diplomat. Um So how do we want to start here? There's also Coven, which I'm unsure if you want to play with it or not. I guess we're going to open with a Bounty Hunter. Bounty Hunter is also nice with um, Diplomat. He's got the 5-2, alright. He goes for the, this place and um, on our Three, just the silver. Um, so, do we want to play with Shepherd? I think we do, right? Oh, uh, you could also go for this Diplo thing. Mm. Like you don't have to go for shepherd draw here and um, still undecided on whether we want to do it, but let's just go for it. And here this could be Stampede, it could also be a Displace. I think I like the Stampede here. It should guarantee that we draw our deck and then we can get a Displace next turn. Also going for the shepherd draw. Yeah, I mean that this place um, should play nicely with um, with shepherd draw. Um, we play on here. There is shepherd and a green card on top, but it's only one. Uh, let's play on. Okay. So we're just gonna draw through. And get a displace here. There's no buy. This could be exile estate stampede again. We're gonna get the display. The, the estate back into our deck eventually. So he doesn't seem to care for Coven either. Oh, I don't know if we need to stampede here, do we? Certainly wanna hit five. Um, yeah, let's just get another displace here. 
don't need to draw our our deck this turn. Um, I think we're gonna go for a native village as well. We need some form of we need actions. Could also be a royal carriage. Mm. Silver into could be silver into carriage and a native village. I think that's not too bad. There's some way of them. Well, diplos are also nice with way of the mole, so Still not sure if well, we're we're going for the the shepherd draw now, but um, the plus might be another way to do your thing here. He's going hard on the shepherds, just so many shepherds. Okay, so let's set aside here and. I think now we want a second shepherd as well. And we want to get these estates back into our deck now. There. there should be an estate on top, right? He's just going nuts for these shepherds. Okay. Um, let's exile a copper here. Well, maybe we're gonna wait with the exiling, play the shepherd first. And do we want a carriage here? If we do, there won't be... Well, we have another shepherd in there, right? We did gain one, so I think it's all right to trigger this. And here you can just exile a copper. Well, maybe we don't even want to do that. Let's do it like this. And maybe we could mole here. Oh, that was nice. That was real. That was real nice for us. And here. Might be we get this estate stuck on our mat, but that's alright. Maybe we can add a diplomat now. Uh, what's it gonna do for us? Like, what what do we wanna do here long term? Just displace some more. Uh, it does give us some more actions. 
Uh, that's a good one. It's not gonna give us actions here. He's he's still got all his coppers. Well, I guess a fair bit of them on, are on his native village mat. We for sure have a slimmer deck. It's got so many shepherds though. Five. Five in play. And he's got one more, so he's got six shepherds. Seven now. More. He's going for all the all the shepherds. Yeah. That's a lot of shepherds. Well, you can mold them, so maybe it's all right. This is a really nice starting hand for us. So we carriage here. Um, there's. Two displaces on top, right? I think we draw here. Okay, so there's a this place on top and there's lots of green in our discard so we don't want to trigger now because we don't have a shepherd in there so we're just gonna set aside here and I guess this place twice could this place into carriage? This place into this place. Mm. Oh, maybe we. Well, we can exile the Diplo and get it back. I <clears throat> think I like that more. We get some coins. And this could be a native village. Him having eight shepherds to our two is a bit concerning. I guess we would like to have like at least one more. So he picked up there with his um, native village. He still got all these coppers in his deck so we're hoping that he's he's gonna choke on them at some point um, it's not happened so far um, what's he gonna do here get um he's got Another displays that he can play here, which he's gonna do. Just goes for a duchy um, and the province, so just full on greening mode. 
Um, so let's set aside here. Oh, there's both our displaces on there now, so I think we want to get them. Um, so let's let's set aside again here and I guess we're gonna pick up now. The diplos are putting in some work. But we don't have any money now, which <laughs> is a bit unfortunate. We need more, we need more just places or ways to Ways to draw, uh, ways to turn stuff into other stuff. Um, let's get a diplo, or well, maybe a village green. That's nice with mole. I mean, he's he's got a choke on the. The coppers at some point, right? But maybe not fast enough that we can catch him somehow. Just mauling, mauling the stuff now. Alright, so this turn wasn't ideal for him. That's good for us to see. Okay, so let's let's set aside here. Set aside a diplomat, and we wanna we wanna get this native village back. I think. And now we mold the village green, play it now. Okay, that worked. Um, so, just gonna displace this stuff now. And we can top deck one of these. Alright. Yeah, this isn't doing a whole lot what we are doing. Um, moving too slow. We need to be displacing stuff into provinces now. Um, he's gonna empty these duchies soon, I think, and then we're in in trouble. Okay. 
because then we'll have lost you know, after that she pile empties. Maybe we should have went for this um, Diplo thing from the beginning and not playing like half Shepherd, half um, half the other thing. Because now all our estates are in exile and the Shepherds are pretty useless by now. So um, that wasn't ideal changing strategy mid game. Even though we kind of had to, because um, he's got eight to our two shepherds, so he just picked this thing and went with, with it. So now he's going, he's um, looking to empty native villages. Okay, so we really, really need to score now. Um. How do we best do this? We could play like a... Oh, I guess we're gonna mole one of these shepherds. Uh, could also play one first, don't discard anything and then do it like this. Alright. Um. Set aside here. I'm gonna displace this bounty hunter into a gold that will then become a province hopefully. So we need to draw here, all right. So we get to this, this place, this gold, and wanna displace for another another thing. We need more draw, don't we? So. Get, just get a, another Diplo. Right. Well, I don't think we'll be able to to catch up before he empties native villages, but maybe we're lucky. I mean, he's got lots of green and copper and stuff, so. Might might not be able to buy anything. Um, might have his this place is bottom decked. That's our hope. Yeah, I think if we went for this displaced Diplo thing from the beginning, it would look a lot better for us. Because then also um, his rush would take longer. Um, he's almost got it here, so we need to basically double score double province here, and we can't do that, can we? 
Well, maybe he's gonna be fun too, but I doubt. I doubt it. Um, let's pick up here. We need to need to displace one of these. And to a duchy, I guess. We can displace this and get our gold back. Um, top deck the two, the two golds. So well, we need him to hit uh, two with two here, but he's not gonna with two with this, right? So GG. Oh. If it went any longer, we would have caught up, but um, it just played a more focused thing than we did. All right, let's see if we can make the next one go our way. We'll be on his start. And this one is looking interesting. There is populate. Um, populate livery. So that is just nuts. Um, so that's what you want to do. Um, there's not really a village. I mean, there's Diplo, but uh, I guess you could activate it, uh, but it's tough, tough to do. Um, it goes for the stockpile gear, and we're gonna do that as well because that seems like a real good way to hit populate. Um, we're gonna have nine on this next hand, right? Um, if we set aside two coppers, that is. And nine could be livery stockpile. Let's do that. Goes for the cavalry. That's interesting. Triggering here, getting the delivery in play. Ah, oh, that's pretty good actually. Gets a diplo. All right. So yeah, I think livery stockpile sounds good. We definitely we do we 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 really want a livery in play. 
um, if we manage to populate. Um, do we want a cavalry here? Maybe. Um, we're well. Might be nice. Might be nice. What else are we gonna do here? Stockpile. That's cavalry. All right, and now we can next turn set aside livery stockpile, and then it's looking pretty good for the for the populate thing. Um, and what do we want here? Another stockpile, I think, just to increase. Like really increase our chances of populating. Okay. Oh, set these two aside and don't buy anything. And there's the populate livery. Okay. That's what we wanted. Um, looks like he's going to be. Oh, that, that's way of the frog is a nice way to activate Diplo, isn't it? Uh, he gets to do the thing as well, and you even you even gain a cavalry with the populate, which is also pretty nuts. Um, just a random order here. And do we want a cavalry on? I think we do. We want to get through this shuffle ASAP. And here, do we want more stockpiles now? Mm, or do we want something else? I guess we do. We want them back in our deck. Let's <laughs> be 30 card, 30 card decks. Both got them now. And what now is the question? Got these blown up decks now over terminals like nothing else. Oh. We're gonna populate anyway, right? I mean, we have to do it. Just too nice to get all these horses. But then, what do we actually do with your deck? We'll see. We're gonna see if we actually get to do anything. Putting gears, putting all the stuff on top of his deck. Ooh, all to activate the Diplo, I guess. Wow. <laughs> That's a nice um, Diplo activation chain. I mean, it's good, right? He can also activate his next Diplo and then play Hunting Ground, so that seems real good. Pretty funny um, to which uh, length, length you have to go to activate this, these Diplomats. And that's bo both. That's both of his diplos. You get to 
you get to order this stuff. Uh, seems like seems like you you get to choose the order and it's not the order you played it in. Yeah, yeah. These these happen all at once, right? When you discard this from play. Um, so, more stockpile, oh nice, we get to activate a diplomat, yeah, he set that up really nicely, his turn here, and he's gonna so he's making a lot out of all these terminals in his deck. He should also have... Well, how many horses are there? Oh, unclear. So we're gonna do this trick as well. Um, can be, how much is this? This is 12, 16. Um, do we want to frog any of these? Like, a gear, for example. We already frogged the cavalry, so it doesn't seem great to now frog the gear. We're just gonna populate again and gain a million horses. That's what we're gonna do. And maybe if we draw two bucks, we could do it twice. Um, oh, only one. Only one. Maybe. So, do we want to trigger this shuffle? Put all these stockpiles. I mean, we put a bunch of horses in. You can put all the stockpiles in and then trigger and then buy. Yeah, we definitely want to trigger, right? Because we got another batch of populate stuff in there. Is he... Is he then gonna finish on like cavalry gears? I don't know. All right. Um, like, do we want to buy an estate here? Let's buy one. Oh, that's great that we got this diplomat here. Like, maybe we can finish on gears and cavalry with that one estate. We've got a lot of stockpiles in here. Okay, so he's looking to play on. Scoring, alright. 
Gonna draw here. So we should get all our stockpiles here. Is there a finish now? Um, there should be right. Six times three, that's eighteen. We've got twenty. Um, fifteen for the gears. We displace into a duchy by duchy and yeah, tw right. Uh, twenty for duchy plus plus gears and two duchies. That does it. Uh, we could have also finished on states, right? So no, doesn't make a difference. So the estate actually did enable us to win. That's funny. Okay, nice. Oh. Got that one. Um, next one is gonna be our start again. Let's see what kind of board we get. That was just the usual, usual populate craziness. Oh, this is looking. This is looking nicely. Rats with way of the rat. Huh. So rats is trashing, but there's no way to get rid of them. Um. Got mastermind, um, got delivery for the horses, and falconer is extra gains, can gain experiments, which is pretty nice. We could just go double experiment opening, and with way of the rats, maybe we gain some back. Could also go experiment silver, but don't fancy having the silver. Let's go with the double experiments. Falconer can then later also gain Destriers. Um, just more experiments. He hits five, that's good here. Okay, this is also good. And do we want a falconer or a livery? I think we want a falconer. Can, can gain destriers for us as well. And well, livery, of course, is nice with experiments as well. Hmm. Yeah, so maybe we actually want to go for... Also, hits helps us hit... Um, uh, higher price point again. Hmm.
some point we want a mastermind Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go with the Falconer, see what it can do for us. And we really want an action as well, I think. Like a city or a city quarter is expensive, so don't want to do that. Here I think we'll be able to buy a city. No. What's in there? Well, we can also... Maybe we could buy a city quarter. It's not the ideal village right now, but it's gonna be good later. Um, what's in the discard? Three coppers, two estates, and two experiments. Um, do we want to trigger that? This could also be Falconer for experiments by a Destrier. No. Let's just get a city quarter. Like, we want to be able to red for experiments and then falconer, and we want to be able to buy a livery. Archive would be great as well to clear that junk. Oh, yeah, right, we can just. Huh. We can just gain city quarters with Way of the Red, right? So that's actually pretty good. Uh, let's play this experiment. And now we just read this thing. We don't have any experiments in there, which is not good. Um, yeah, sure. This way we can play on. If we draw a city quarter dead here, we just read it. And here, Destria. Yeah, this we are gonna just read. This deck is also doesn't have any experiments anymore. Okay, now, so it's one buy, right? So we need to spend them wisely now. We need a livery and then just masterminds, I think, from there on onwards. And we read the, the city quarters.
Oh, what's <laughs> what's funny is that um, you can activate and deactivate cities with the experiment pile. Haven't thought about that. Okay, um, we play this right, falconer experiment, uh, maybe we just rats the falconer. Rats the Destrier. Yeah, that sounds better than gaining experiment and playing on, doesn't it? We won't get a livery this way, but we get more Falconers, more Destriers. That sounds good. So, these things can just gain themselves. I don't think we want to play the city quarter first here. Uh, this could draw us one more card, but if our Destria fails to to draw any actions, we just rats the city quarter. So, he goes for the rats. Yeah, now that now that we have these city quarters, they're kind of nice also with the livery. Um, yeah, let's play the Destria first. Okay, and we just rats this. Um, we could add a rats as well. Could also be experiment. Let's let's get experiment here to draw a little more. Um, there's a falconer down there. Um, let's play on. There's a Destrier in there, isn't there? Like this would be a turn to hit 5 and buy something like a Mastermind or maybe a City. This could get us a buy eventually. Oh, Mastermind is nicer though at this stage I think. There should be another city quarter down there. Yeah, there it is. Can't rats it if we want to buy a five. It would be real nice to be able to buy a 5 cost. Like livery or a mastermind. Mm. Let's buy a mastermind here. Oh, 
Oh, that did activate his falconer. All right. Did um, duplicate his falconer there. Okay. Okay, this, this was nice to draw the city quarter here. Um, more experiment. Um, this could be where we gain a rats. Yeah, let's gain a rats here. There's two city quarters on top, right? Mm. Oh, it could be nice to draw them in duplicate, so let's try. There's a city quarter on top now. So let's play the mastermind and What is this gonna be? This could be a city. Um, or maybe just another mastermind. Let's get another mastermind. Okay, this is nice. This is real nice. I think we're gonna triple the falconer. Oh, he's drawing deck. All right. Yeah, maybe hmm, we would really like to get a city, right? Because this will now give us by. Uh, we need a city though. Can we just autopile this on um, like rats? Like we triple four experiments here. Then we need to play fourteen rats. Ah, that's too much. That's we can't win this way. We triple the falconer experiment destriers. Can we win on Destriers? Don't have enough actions, do we? Oh, we do, right? We discard four times for Destriers, Falconer for Experience, buy Experiments, and we have one more VP. Ah, oh, that's a win. Nice. Um.
Oh, that came unexpected. <laughs> All right, nice. Got that one. Okay, so into the last game, which we will. No, he will be starting the last one. This two to two, I believe, secures us a spot in the knockout stage. But it's not clear yet whether we are gonna be um, first or second place finisher in our group. If we win 3 1, then we'll be first, I believe, guaranteed. Alright, what is this? There's rats again, nice with sheepdog. There's a vampire that you wanna get. Um, so you could do a could do a cursed gold opening, so to speak, and get a vampire here with your four, and maybe a sheep dog as well. Yeah. Is that worth it? For sure, nice to get a vampire into your shuffle. Like, if you had Cursed Gold here, you would open Vampire as well, wouldn't you? He goes with the rats, okay. Yeah. Uh, gonna try the Cursed Gold opening. And... A yeah, Scrap is also nice with rats. Or well, maybe we could also get a scrap along with the the vampire. Yeah, let's get a scrap, not the sheepdog. And this could be a rats. And then we should be good with trashing as well. Um, don't think we want to take another curse, do we? Hmm. There's our scrap on the bottom. Got an estate with it, which is all right. Yeah, let's not take a curse for a four cost. Just bam for stables. All right. He's trashing nicely, real nice. Um, so let's draw and take a coin maybe. Could hit five for another vampire. We don't, but that's fine as well. Do we want a village green? The sheep dog. Let's get a village green here. Okay, this is a nice draw. Get to play the rats and the stables. And our bat. Um, 
think again we just trash don't trash as much as we can um well that's fine hit the rats um we're gonna take card horse here put a horse into the shuffle oh nice we draw it and second vampire i think What's this vampire gonna gain for us? Another stables. Later we want to add a market square. Another stables is good for now. Okay, now it's looking good, I think. Um, this last turn and this turn. Both are looking real good. Oh, oh we played right. So down there is, I think, two coppers, scrap, and stables. Don't think we play on here. There's village green, copper, scrap, and stables. So maybe we do play on because the only bad thing is drawing the copper. Oh. So we could get like sheepdog market square here. If we do desperation, just think is fine. We need to find a treasure for our stables to trash here. Oh, he did resign. All right. Okay. Thanks for the games. Um, so makes it three one for us, which means I think that we are guaranteed to finish the the group in first place. Yeah, he had nine rats in his I believe I guess he had a five rats hand or something like that there, which led him to resign. So um we'll see each each other in the knockout stage and I think we're We'll be playing the second place finisher of the butterfly group, but I don't know who that is yet, who that is yet. So see you every see everybody there. Thank you for watching and listening and goodbye.